Lauren, you make loving fun. I never imagined I'd find someone as perfect for me as you. I love your spirit, I love your positivity, and I love your big heart. I love that you lift me up and encourage me to be at my best. Most of all, I love that I get to marry my best friend. You're in my safe place, all while pushing me past my comfort zone. Your smile lights me up in a way I've never imagined. You make my heart happy. Oh, you look gorgeous. Thank you, Dad. I love you. I love you, too. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh. Holy smokes. Oh, man. That is fabulous. You look gorgeous. Oh. Oh. Oh, man. I tell you. You, uh, you, you sure that, uh, you know, he's going to... Uh, be worthy of all this. <laughs> You're so sweet. Yeah? This is stunning. Thank you. Are there like a million buttons on the back? Because I want to, oh good, I want to know that he had to work at it. <laughs> I'm just saying. You know? <laughs> I love you. Oh, I'm so excited for you. I just can't wait to make you cry. Oh my God, I'm going to cry. I'm going to cry so many times. You've opened my eyes to all the adventures this world has to offer, and I can't wait to continue exploring it with you. I love that you've inspired me to be the best version of myself, and I'm never letting you go. Oh my gosh, you look so beautiful. I love you so much. Oh babe, you're the sweetest. You look so handsome. You look so handsome. Your hair and makeup look great. Thank you. I love you so much. I can't I wait to too. marry you. You are forever my best friend and one true love. I promise to give you my heart, my passion, my trust, and my loyalty. I promise to grow with you. I promise to lift you up with all the encouragement I can offer. I can't wait to share the rest of our lives together. I promise to fall in love with you over and over again every day. To love doesn't mean every day is an easy day. When you hit a bump in the road, remember what brought you here today. Love intentionality, joy, honesty, a true desire to support each other in your respective efforts to be your best self. The pledge you make today expresses your devotion to one another, to the love you share, and to the truth of who you are to each other. Today, in the presence of your families, your friends, and what a wonderful group of human beings, you pronounce your love for each other and make a commitment to love one another to the mountains and back. Since the ancient times, the ring has been a symbol of unbroken because it's a circle of love with no beginning and no end. Love given freely has no giver and no receiver, for each is the giver and each the receiver. May, may these rings remind you of the freedom and the power that this commitment you make has today. Carter and Lauren, inasmuch as you have pledged yourselves to each other and have declared the same in the presence of this company, by the exchange of the vows and the giving and receiving of the rings, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now seal, seal these vows with a kiss.
Internet, I'm Jenna, and there's probably a good chance that you've already met me, as Lauren and I have been pretty much inseparable since we were paired together as freshman year roommates. Um, Move-in day at the dorm, I was incredibly intimidated by Lauren. She was smart and confident and knew what bedding to buy, and she was outgoing and gorgeous, and I just thought, how does someone do their hair like that? <laughs> um, she immediately began pushing me to be a better version of myself, and I think most people in this room can relate to that. I was honestly never worried that I was losing my best friend with Carter. I truly felt like I had gained another best friend. I cannot wait to see where life takes you both, but don't worry, Carter, I'll be there too. <laughs> you both look absolutely beautiful tonight. I love you both so much. I wish Sundog was here to see you all dressed up like this. So please help me in congratulating the happy couple. Cheers to Mr. and Mrs. Big and Little Butt. <laughs> so thank you, Dale Dog, for saying that earlier. I feel fortunate that I'm one of those friends that I've known Carter since elementary school. Really started becoming good friends in middle school, if you remember. You know, we share a lot of the same things that, you know, going snowboarding, camping. I think it's so special that you guys chose Colorado. We've had so many good memories with Carter and with Lauren. Uh, snowboarding up here at Loveland Pass. Um, had some really special moments. So I think it's really special that you guys picked this place. For me and Carter, is the juice worth the squeeze? Absolutely. <laughs> Lauren, thank you so much for opening up Carter to the world of travel. I thought he was never going to get there, and it shows that you're a very, very strong person to get him there. And that is amazing. <laughs> But let's raise our glasses to Carter and Lauren, to really special people here. Yeah. <laughs> so my name is Kate Hilton, and I'm Lauren's older sister. Lauren and Carter, you both look so happy today. I don't think you guys have stopped smiling. <laughs> I want to thank you both, Mom and Randy, Dad and Jerry, for all of your efforts and preparation for today. Everything is just beautiful especially you, Lauren. Carter, we could not be more excited to have you join our family. You're a perfect match for Lauren. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> and that's evident in countless ways. Thank you for loving my sister so well. For those of you who don't know Lauren, she's loving, naturally curious, and always seeking adventure. Whether canoeing in, a, in the dark on a family trip or accidentally covering herself in industrial grade construction glue with our sisters, as you all have already heard. There is never a dull moment when she's around. The thing that I love most about my sister is how loyal she is and how deeply she loves. Lauren is lighthearted, fun loving, easygoing, never too serious, except for when it comes to caring for and loving for her family and friends. She always shows up, maybe a tad late, but <laughs> she'll always be there for her people. Carter, you never need to doubt your, her love for you, and she will always support you in any way that she can. Lauren, I was so thrilled that you chose to make Kansas City your home after college. It has been such a blessing to have you close. It's still mind-boggling that two girls from Minnesota would grow up, would marry men that grew up 13 blocks away from each other off Nall Avenue in Kansas City. Of all the adventures you two have taken and have yet to take, your marriage will be the best adventure there is. Lauren and Carter, I wish you a lifetime of happiness and health together. May God bless you. Please raise your glass to the new Mr. and Mrs. House. Or better known in my family as Yo-Yo and Car Car. Cheers. Carter, I feel like the luckiest woman in the world standing in front of you today and having the opportunity to share all of my love with you. You are the man of my dreams. I love how you protect me, even enough to jump out of bed to make sure I was safe. 
You are so intentional. You are giving and compassionate. You express your love openly and without reservation. There isn't a day that goes by that I don't hear that I love you. Thank you so much. You are loyal. You are my foundation, unwavering, calm, and secure. You are my balance, my security, my safe place, and my best friend. You have changed my life, Carter. You have helped me see the love that I deserve. You encourage me to continue to find and embrace my best self. I love how adventurous we are. I love the memories we have made together with so many people here today. We have one life to live and I couldn't imagine a better partner to do it with. I promise to be faithful and loyal to you. I promise to grow with you. I promise to laugh with you. I promise to prioritize your needs. I promise to uh, see you and hear you. I promise to love you always and forever.